how to increase visibility for your business in order to outpace your biggest competitors and appear in the top position online. I will show you how to do this using Localo. The first thing you need to do when entering Localo is to add your business. It could be this business and you click on it. Then you check here to make sure that the company's headquarters is indeed located here. If so, you confirm it. Next, what you do is select keywords, the words that Localo will check to see how visible your business is, how visible your competitors are, who your competitors are, and based on that, it will also prepare guidelines for your business profile, optimization guidelines. So, Dentista v Novem Yorku, this is a very good keyword, it's also fine, I'm adding it here. That's fine too. Let's assume these are the words I wanted to add. It is important to add words here that accurately describe what we want to sell, what we are selling, our services, and the most important services on which we have the highest margin and want to sell. The most important thing is to promote, and then we click here and now. Localo checks how visible our company is for each of the keywords we selected in the area, in a large area around our business, for example. In the city or some specific area, we can see here that for this keyword, I am in 36th position. I can click, for example, in this place and see exactly where the specific competitors are located that are showing up with whom I am competing here. Look, if someone were to type this word in this place, I would be competing with companies from here. There are no companies from this region here. It looks nice. It looks nice, nice. And here I click. I'm back. And now I can click here and see the same thing. So here, if someone types that word, companies like these will show up. Here is the first company. Here is the second. Here is the third. Here is the fourth. And so on. We go back here. And I can browse through each and every word and see how it looks. Once I've looked at how visible my company is, of course, the longer I stay in Localo, the better. Because all my history is here. I can look at it, click on a specific date, and see how my company was visible at that particular time. As if at a specific time, a specific time, and as if at a specific time, and as if I have already done this, then I click here to see the tasks. The point is that Localo analyzes your business profile every week, gathering our knowledge, data about your competitors, and information about the industry to prepare tasks for you to complete. And usually, there are three tasks for each week. For example, this week it could be three photos for your business profile. Either create a poster to gather reviews and collect them, or add your business to these directories. We go in here, select the photos and the photo to publish, then we just click on the publish button on Google, and then we simply click publish on Google. Then we can also enable protection for the company's profile against competitors' actions, so they don't change anything in the company's profile and so on. There will simply be a lot of these tasks and they will come in every week. Next, what we can easily and quickly do in Localo is create a website with one click based on the data from our company profile. Unfortunately, I don't have a page to show right now. But even on the free plan in Localo, we can go in here and click Create, and then we will have a really nice website for our company created with just one click. Here we can definitely see an example of another company showing how this page might ultimately look. It is really nice and looks great, containing key information about the company, and it is well developed. I recommend using it. At any moment, we can enter the position map here and check how visible our company is. Next, what can we do? We have competitors here. We can go into this tab and check what and when our biggest competitors did certain things. We can see that. This competitor. Oh. This competitor changed the company description. This one has just received one review. This one was doing something. With the reviews again. Let's see. This one changed the category. Something new is happening here. Additional data is being filled in. Take a look at what has been going on here. Some categories have been changing. Thanks to this feature, I can check what my competitors were doing as well as what I am doing in my business profile. To draw better conclusions, prepare better or optimization plans, and so on. Later, I have statistics. Unfortunately, for this company, I do not have a connected Google account, so I cannot show the statistics. I can show it for that reason. So how many phone calls did I have? How many did I have? 
In the last 30 days, how many messages to the business? How many root directions? How many in the last 30 days? How many profile views of the business? Here I can also see how it looks over time, what this trend looks like, just as how many local analyses it has done for us. That's quite a few analyses. I haven't done anything definitely. How many reviews we responded to, how many photos we added, and so on. Overall, how our company's visibility looked before Localo, and how it looks now with Localo. As we work with Localo, it really looks nice and promising here. However, this business profile has been worked on for a while now, to be precise, for a year. And what can we do here? We can go to the Post tab and click Create Post. I will also show this for another company that I have access to. We can click Create Post and literally create an entry, literally with one click, because artificial intelligence creates the content for us. We can also click here to publish on my Facebook profile and choose to publish on this Facebook profile. I can add a photo here. I can add a call to action button, for example. Call, read more, etc. And then I need to specify when I want this post to be published, and then I click to schedule the publication of this post. Here I also have a calendar. I can see what entries have been published. I scroll down here, look at all the posts, and see when a specific post was published on my business profile on Google, or on Facebook as it looks here. So today I can plan 10 posts with artificial intelligence and click to set them to publish, for example, every month. And I have 10 months of work taken care of. Here is a very nice feature for publishing photos. I click this button, I can upload 100 photos here and click automatic publication. What will happen then? That Localo will automatically choose when to publish the next photos and how many to publish. And it will also determine the order of publication here, regardless of how we upload these photos or how we add them to Localo. Localo will establish the best possible publication option by itself. This is how it should look, so the only thing we need to do is, for example, Add 100 photos here and click publish automatically and the rest will happen by itself. Here we have offers. We can also create them in Localo, adding offers to the company's profile on Google, also with artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence can create a title, it can create a description for us, then we also provide a link to the website and set the duration of the offer, and we can publish it now or schedule the publication of this offer, and offers in the future. Another thing we have not specifically for this business profile, since it is still loading, is citations. Currently in beta phase, which means business directories. And here we have a tab showing which directories. We still need to add our business to. Here we can see where the business is already available. We can click here and see what this directory looks like, or if there is something that needs to be improved. And we also have information about where we lost the listing meaning something happened and our company is no longer visible there, it is no longer available in that directory. What's really cool here is that if I add something, for example, on Instagram, I can click here, mark it as done, and then it goes to processing. This means that just because I created a directory, it doesn't mean that it is already working in favor of my business and that it is visible on Google. And here, thanks to this, we can verify how many directories we have created and whether they are already visible online, whether they are positively impacting our business, and whether they have a beneficial effect. If we move the catalog here and it appears on Google, Localo will automatically move it to the active tab or we can also do it manually. And what happens here later is that we can go to this tab, hover over the date and see exactly what happened with a specific directory and when. Thanks to this, we can see when we created the catalog, how long we waited for Google to index it, meaning simply that the company is visible and will be shown online. This will start to have an effect after some time. We can track everything here very nicely. And we can change these statuses. If we determine that a certain directory is not our directory, as it can happen, then let's add it to the ignored list, or if we see that one has expired or something, although Localo does this automatically. When Localo finds that a directory has expired, it moves it to expired, but sometimes we can also click here to move it to lost. Next, there is a tab with reviews, and here I will move on to another company. And here, we see all the reviews from our customers. And what is really nice is that we can click Let's Begin. 
and then Locarlo automatically generates a response to that specific review using artificial intelligence. We can click this button here, change a bit what we want to reply to this lady, and then click reply. I successfully responded. And look, the reply to the review went well. It's detailed and looks really great. This feature also incredibly streamlines responding to reviews. Furthermore, there are templates for responding to reviews. We can simply create a template for responding to reviews and click that this template is for three star reviews without any comments and we are ready to respond. And now this template is created here. If I receive some feedback, a three star review, then I can use localo.ai here, but I can also use one of the predefined templates. So I can really just click through this and click choose this suggestion because it is a template created by me. Furthermore, this is a poster for gathering feedback. We can generate a poster for collecting reviews here with just a few clicks, even in the free plan on Localo, and then print it in A5 or A4 format, etc., and distribute to our clients or bring it on the wall, take a picture, and send a command and a text message to our clients. How we do this really depends on us, and we are only limited by our own creativity. This allows us to gather feedback from our clients very easily, cheaply, quickly, and effectively. I recommend choosing a few words here that very well describe your services, what you do, and your quality. Since customers will later be influenced by what they see here, they will write such reviews. They will write detailed reviews with content that will positively impact your business. And here I will show you such an example. For this company, we created a poster for gathering reviews. And here you can see that this company had two reviews here at 24. From the fourth, it had two reviews. Then it was like, 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 like. Then we started giving customers this poster for collecting feedback, for leaving reviews about the company, for providing reviews about the company. And then customers left reviews. And now it shows that there are already 11 reviews. So it works really well. The last feature that is here in Localo is the audit, if we have experience. In data analysis, I recommend getting involved here, and we can learn something interesting. However, if we don't want to mess anything up, I recommend using the weekly tasks, and that will really be enough to improve your business profile and increase its visibility. What is here is the same as what is in the audit, and even more so, it is presented in a much better, accessible format with better design. So I simply recommend that you make use of the tasks. And now there are also additional agency functions in the premises that I would like to show. This is the sales function. The point is that I can find clients from a specific industry in a specific area to whom it is worth reaching out and saying whether we can help them. For example, it could be a dentist in New York. Dentist in New York. I click here to find clients and here I simply have all the clients sorted simply so what i can do now is see that this one and that one have a website this one doesn't have a website and neither does that one so maybe that's why they are also ranked low i can quickly and efficiently go through here and see the position map i can very easily and quickly take a screenshot go to here is a simple screen grab i can then go in and easily find his phone number on Google. Call him and tell him to give me his email because I will explain to him how to increase his company's visibility online. I will help him, present him with an offer, and then I can send him that screenshot showing that he is simply invisible and I can help him become visible. Next, we have what's called research mode. It looks like this. If a client comes to us and asks for an offer, we can go in here, enter their company name, and then input relevant keywords for them. In the second stage, OK, a uh, dentist. We can enter the keywords here, then see the company's position and simply take a screenshot here and attach it to the offer, saying, you know, you are very low, but we will tell you how to make your company more visible so that it ranks higher on the internet. So we need to do this very nicely. Agencies also have an additional feature called difficulty. 